Hi, several of you were confused on the rotating pencil assignment. You didn't know exactly how to hold the pencil and how to rotate the pencil. Um, so this is just you know a 30 second video to explain to you what I want you to do. So just take a regular pencil and um, these are the three cases that I want you to consider. One of them is that you hold the pencil between, uh, well, let's use two hands. Um, so between two index fingers in the middle, in the, in the center, and try to rotate it this way. This is the case number one. So the rotational axis is the is along the pencil head. Okay. The second uh, case is where you still hold it at the same place, but you are not rotating it along the axis of the uh, pencil head, but rotate it like this. Okay. I guess you know people sometimes hold their pencil like this and, and, and play with it like this. So that's the second case. Okay. Oops. So try to rotate it like this with your two fingers. And the third case is again two fingers but you rotate it around the end of the pencil. This is more tricky to hold it but you know if you just press hard enough with your two fingers you'll be able to hold it steady and then try rotating it and, and feel how it is different um, from the other two ways that you try to rotate it. So number one is like this, number two is like this, or you know like this, Number three, the same, but you hold it at the end of the of the pencil, and uh, you're to you're supposed to basically write how it feels, uh, which one of these feels the easiest, and why. And you should able to you should be able to discuss each of these three cases from the point of view of rotational inertia, and uh, basically the one uh, that's easiest to rotate is the one that has the smallest rotational inertia. So pick whichever one you think has this of these three cases has the smallest rotational inertia or the pencil in which of these three cases has the pencil the smallest rotational inertia and why. Don't forget to include why you think uh, that the rotational inertia for that particular case is the smallest. And then just upload upload your answers through the through the link in the Moodle.